Okay, so we got to torque the secondary clutch to 16 foot pounds. So I'm going to apply the brake and lock it so it can't move. And we'll torque this. Sixteen foot pounds. Sixteen point one done. That was easy. There. Get that like that. So this big nut right here that holds this on is gonna be I had to break out the big guns. Ninety five foot pounds. 95. 97. Okay, so this one gets torqued to 66 foot pounds, and then we have to run the motor with a bell down. We run it to 20 miles an hour and hit the brake, and we do that five times, and then we retorque this to 70 foot pounds. All right, we gotta set this to 66. 66 foot pounds. Sixty-six on the dot. All right, so now we'll <clears throat> we'll put the belt on, and then we'll run it. All right, get our little tool out. Okay. So we've got two brand new belts for her. Got uh, one already in the holder. I had to throw that one away. It had a hole in it. And uh, when you flex the belt back between every rib, it was it was cracked all the way to the, uh, the cords on the spare one. So I got rid of that. And then the main belt had a uh, big flat spot in it from uh, being burnt. So we're going to put a brand new spanking belt on it. And the part number for this is, where is it? 415 0 Make sure I'm putting it on the right way. There's the rotation. Make sure that that's going forward. Almost forgot to mention it. You guys already know. But I like to be thorough. I'm thinking she's. She's got to be adjusted a whisker. Yep. I guess we'll do that. The belt deflection. Let's see what we got here. 
the, so the nut is a 10 millimeter. Let's see what this is. Oh, yeah. seems tight that's a little tight so I think I'm gonna have to go in a little bit I guess I can't run that to the <clears throat> I think we gotta go in just a little bit with it I'll run them all into touch yeah it's still dragging a little bit on the clutch we'll go a little bit more See how when I <clears throat> see how when I turn when I turn this over, it's trying to turn the motor over. It's just a whisker tight. I guess we'll try it right there. We'll try it right there. There. All right, I guess it's time to start the old girl. Track alignment. We gotta do some track alignment. Uh, whoo -hoo. <laughs> She's a runner. She's a runner. Okay, so I run that. Uh, I ran it five, six, seven times, up to 20 miles an hour, and I hit the brakes. So now uh, what we'll do is we gotta retorque this to 70 foot pounds. <clears throat> so we got to find them holes, and then we got two 70 foot pounds. Oh, that 
at 70. There it is, 70.8. <clears throat> That's it. <laughs> asphyxiation. Not used to having smoke in the garage. Two stroke smoke. Gotta love it. Alright, I got this. I got this new foam because this was starting to fall apart and I didn't want it to get drawn into the intake, into the carburetor, so I bought a new foam for it. There, all good to go now. I just gotta put these, put this door back on. Oh, it's still smoky in here. Make my eyes water. There's one. He's got a notch in them. They slide down like this. Gotta stop and hit that. There, there's that. Plugs in the holder. This looks good still. Floats around. That's torque. That's torque. That's torque. These are good. <clears throat> 